Hello everyone, I'm Alan from Newlands Nursery and this is today's five minute Friday. Something you can do in the garden that's nice and easy, nice and quick to do, that you can get some great results from. Now we're getting into the autumn period now and it's a perfect time, believe it or not, to sow sweet peas. Everybody thinks about sowing sweet peas in the spring because that's when we're all thinking about the garden. But actually, the autumn is probably the better time to do it. It's nice and simple to do. There's a few things you need to know. So sweet peas are, you can't really say they're hardy, but as long as they're in a frost-free place, like a greenhouse, a conservatory, a windowsill, or if you've got a window in a shed that's frost-free, they're absolutely perfect to do through the winter. Um, so as long as it's frost-free, it's absolutely fine. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna sow it they will start to germinate fairly quickly and for that reason sweet peas are fantastic to do with children um, I always think if you're going to do any growing with children make sure especially when it's sowing make sure it's relatively quick um, they don't want to wait two years for a seed to germinate for obvious reasons they want to see the results and sweet peas they grow quite quickly they're going to grow up something so they always look quite spectacular they're fantastic flowers that you can pick and put in in the house so they're a great all-round plant um, so as far as sowing nice and simple to do so I'll get a pot I'm going to do about five or six pots of them um, not for the video but always do more than you think you're going to need um, and seeds aren't that expensive nice and simple to do so what I'm going to do is I'm going to fill the pot about a finger's depth from the top um, tap it down, getting rid of any air pockets or anything like that. Then I'm going to go for a pot like this. This is a nine centimetre, three inch pot. Um, I'm going to go for around about five seeds. So often with seeds you don't get 100% germination, although with sweet peas you're going to get pretty close to that in general. Um, I'm just going to pop the seeds onto the surface of the compost space them out but don't get too finickety about it space them out and then cover with some more compost nice and simple so I'm just going to sprinkle the compost over and it's a good rule of thumb if your seed is about this depth then it will want to be covered by about that much depth of compost. Very few seeds are actually that deep, but it gives you an idea. So in general, and it doesn't work for 100%, but a lot of things, the depth of the seed, so the, the height of the seed, it wants to have about that much covering of compost over the top of it. Okay, simple as that. So what we do is we we'll water it and we treat it as we would any other plant now we're coming towards the end of september now coming in towards october the weather's still quite nice so this can go outside with no problems at all when we start seeing that it's going to be frosts um, that's when we need to bring it into the conservatory window sill somewhere that's nice and bright and is actually going to keep frost off the plant so it's going to germinate it's going to start growing and once it gets to about this sort of height, you're going to need to stop it. What that means is pinch out the tops uh, and we'll cover that. Um, but what it means, it's going to grow, we're going to need to stop it. That actually is a massive benefit and it's one of the reasons the autumn sown sweet peas are so good. So the moment you pinch that out, it's going to put, make the plant a lot bushier, put a lot of side growth on it. And the more side growth, the bushier the plant, the more flowers we're going to get, the more sturdy the plant is. So that's why the autumn sweet peas are often much, much better than the spring sown ones. So make sure you give it a go. If you've got any questions at all, get in contact, comment on this video, give us a call, whatever you like, we're here to help.